So this is where the tomb used to be, mm -hmm. the coffin. Now, during the time when we start, for, when we opened the first time the museum, uh, this is where the dispatch used to be. So during the night, somebody is staying inside. It could be a woman or a man. Most of the time, in the nearby the date where Mircea died, they can hear steps around. But they close the castle. At 8 o'clock in the evening, nobody comes in. So they close the castle and they hear steps walking around. It's like they walk around. <laughs> but, except there is no, no person. And it goes up there. And it's nobody inside the castle, and they, they can see the light coming on. When they go to check, they shut the light, they come back, and after five minutes, the light will come back again. They go again. Well, it has to, I have to be uh, honest with you. The guy which is working over there is very brave because nobody wants to go and check why the light comes off and on when it's nobody over there. So for the first time when it happened, the first guy that was here, he quit his job. And then the second guy went up there, he shot the light, the light come, up, come on again, but he didn't have the courage to go again to check because you know nobody wants to check something like this when they know it's nobody inside. So that's one of the most scary story because we had like five people hired, but nobody wants to stay when they see the light coming off. And, but also they can hear. And then I have to be honest, it was two guys from Belgium that they jump in using this part and they arrived inside. Over here it's a shooting window for archers. They push, uh, push it on and they jump inside. Now, the guy which was working inside, he got very scared. So you don't have to really believe all the stories, but sometimes horrible things are happen with no explanation. Like, the, like you can hear people walking around, and you can see the light coming on and off just behind the tomb of Prince Mircha. We had some ghost hunters that they had special equipment, and they said, because I was here with them, they hear the voice of Prince Mircha screaming for help. And, you know, when it comes to this part of uh, the story, uh, blood will cry out loud, and it's a verse in the Bible. If something happens and you cannot finish that part of the story, they will scream and they will ask for justice. Now, obviously, the justice will come one year later, 10 years later, 100 years later, even 1,000 years later. For us, uh, the justice is meaning, uh, it means to stop the cruel part of the story when Dracula was betrayed by the Hungarian king. This is the way we believe the story will end. We hope that it will end soon in a night with full moon like it was tonight.